Welcome to the AMTS video manual. In this section, we will illustrate the file structure of amts.cattle.pro, how it is held on your computer, and how you can share files with other users or with support. The AMTS program is held in two places on your computer. This is so that you can easily share files between other users of amts.cattle.pro. When you download AMTS Pro, it is installed on the C drive of your computer under Program Files times 86. There you will find it under AMTS, the amts.cattle.professional folder. This is the folder that occasionally you may be asked to uninstall. When we have new versions of the program, there are situations where sometimes it overwrites better if it, if an older version is uninstalled. This would be the location that you would uninstall by right-clicking and choosing Delete to uninstall the program. The other location on your computer where amts.cattle.pro files are held is under your Documents part. And these are your local documents. This is where all of your farm files, all of your feed banks, anything that has to do with the program are held. In the rare occasion that we ask you to uninstall the program, if you're having specific problems, none of these folders are actually disturbed. And these are the folders that you would save and move over to a new computer so that you have all of your old work. You will find under the documents, AMTS, amts.cattle.pro folder, you'll find all of the different folders. These are where you will pull files that you can share with people. If you look at your current farm folders, this will be a list of all of the farms that you're working with in your particular program. These would be the attachments that you can save to a memory stick or save on the cloud. They would also be the attachments that you add to an email if you're trying to email a farm or in a troubleshooting situation when an AMTS staff member asks you to email a farm to them, this is where you'll go. These folders are also the location where any other file that you would share with another AMTS user would be held. Custom reports can be shared. Documents usually are things like the manual. Farm backup folders are backups of your current farm files. Every time you open the farm, a copy is automatically saved in a file underneath that particular dairy's name. So you can see how many times you opened it. You can limit the number of files that are kept. Best management practices is to show fewer farms than I have right here. And also, this is a way that you can go back to something if you have something go terribly wrong in a, in a farm that you're working in. You can go back to a previous copy. You also will find that you are able to store feed analysis that you receive by download or through an email. An X, a standard XML file is saved in this folder, and that's where the program knows to access those when you import a feed analysis feed banks that you create and the feed banks that come from AMTS are held in the feed bank folder. You can also store templates that you've created in the forms of mix output templates, monthly data templates, and ration output templates. These are all able to be stored in these folder locations and these are where you would go to share them with another user. Let's demonstrate the method that would be used to email a problem file to one of our people. So we're going to send a file to Lynn. We want her to help. We want her to give us some help with this farm. So all we would do is go into our documents, AMTS, amts.cattle.com. Pro, current farms, and I'm going to send this Keswick Dairy Farm to her. And it is very helpful for us when we're trying to perform some troubleshooting on your farm. If you include in the body of the email, maybe a screenshot of what was happening or try to describe what you were doing before the error happened or what you have for a question. 
This information and more details about how you can save your work, share your files, and saving shared files with other users and the file structure are found written out in the user's manual. You can access the user's manual at any time from your program through either the help menu, view user's manual, or if you're more comfortable with a management console, go to the home screen and click on view user's guide. Clicking that will bring the user's manual up in your browser. You will find more information on the file structure of ants.cattle.pro in section 1.6, starting on page 19 in the user's guide. Thank you, and as always, if you have any questions or comments, contact ants at support at agmodelsystems.com.